How's it going guys? My name is Dennis and in today's video I'm going to show you guys the faster way to make money in GTA Online before the gun running DLC. Now before we get started, as always if you enjoyed today's video or if this video does help you out then please do drop a like. And as always if you could subscribe to the channel it would be absolutely amazing. We're only 25 subscribers away from 1000. So as always when we hit 1000 subscribers I will be doing a spending spree. Now if you look at the top right hand corner uh, right now I do have exactly 10 million in my maze bank account. I do nearly have 11 million, so I do have the money prepared to do the spending spree when the gun running DLC does come out. So if you do want me to do a spending spree, then as always, subscribe to the channel to see that video. But today, I'm going to show you guys how to make money. Now, a lot of you guys did ask me um, to make money tutorials because the gun running DLC is going to be super expensive. A lot of you guys want to make money so you can buy all the new stuff. So today, I'm going to show you guys a super fast way to make money, if not the fastest way to make money in GTA 5. So let's get into it. So the first step, you actually need a CEO for this method. Now, if you don't have a CEO, don't worry, I will be doing more money methods, NRP methods, later on this week. So again, subscribe to the channel if you do want to see those videos. But today, we're going to be focusing on a CEO mission. Now, if I do uh, log into my uh, computer right now, I'm actually going to be doing some special work. Because if you don't know already, all special works right here do have double money NRP. But today's mission is actually the ramp, ramp buggy mission. Now, the reason I'm doing the ramp buggy mission is because it's the fastest way to actually make money out of any of the missions. Now the reason it's the fastest is because it's the quickest and it gives you the same amount of money as any of the other missions. Now this loading might take a while but I'm going to put it on hard. But even if you put it on hard it is super easy. Now I will be inviting my friend CJ. So big shout out to my friend CJ for helping, out, helping me out with today's uh, video. And as always if you want to join my um, crew or if you, you want to join uh, my videos. And as always leave your PSN name in the comments because I do read all my comments. And if you um yeah if you want to help me out with videos, leave your PSN name in the comments and I will reply to you. And you can make videos with me, or you can just join me and uh, have a talk with me. But yeah, today we're going to be focusing on the ramp buggy mission. And today I'm going to be giving you guys a full tutorial on how to complete it really fast and easily. Now you don't want to do it too fast because um, as I already mentioned in other uh, money method videos, the longer you are in the actual um, mission, the more money you will be getting. But today we're going to be focusing on how to get money the fastest. So I will be doing a um. I'm going to be giving you guys uh, time slots, uh, which like what time you get the certain payout. Now the optimal like time to finish the mission is actually um, 10 minutes. So um, under 10 minutes is a waste of time. No, under 10 minutes isn't too good, but over 10 minutes is just a waste of time. 10 minutes is the best um, timing to finish missions. And the reason why is because uh, under 10 minutes you won't, be, you won't be getting the full like potential and over 10 minutes is way too long and you're just wasting time so doing a mission for 10 minutes is the optimal time for getting the money the fastest but yeah, uh, the first thing you're going to be doing is actually getting into a helicopter and flying to the thing now landing does take quite a long time and if you are pretty skilled uh, parachuting is way quicker so once you get above the actual um, thing I'm gonna actually uh, just parachute so we are actually right above the actual thing so hopefully um, CJ uh, realize, realizes we have to jump out but jumping out is way quicker than um, doing uh, actually um, landing because landing is pretty risky because you can actually hit one of the wires wires and explode your helicopter so parachuting is way quicker and um, to be honest it is quite easy if you know how to do it but yeah, uh, landing on the road is pretty fine as well as long as you don't die but yeah, landing is pretty difficult because there is a ton of buildings but if you like, land on the road right here it's pretty simple right there I actually um, kind of failed but I still uh, don't, didn't really take that much damage, I only took like a tenth of my health. But yeah, CJ actually um, jumped down as well, so he actually um, realised. But yeah, um, I'm, I'm actually going to be the one in the ramp buggy, just to make the video more interesting. Hopefully CJ's okay with that, um, he's actually going to be the guy in the um, uh, secure serve vehicle. And hopefully he um, gets in there quickly. But yeah, um, you, actually, you don't actually really have to wait for your friend to get into the um, thing. You can just start driving this way, because I already know this mission quite well. I'm just going to wait for him just to um, help him out. Cause I, the ramp buggy guy, the person in the ramp buggy, does actually have to protect the um, security serve vehicle. Because there is police in the way. And the ramp buggy will kind of like smash them out of the way. And that's how you're going to uh, lead your friend to um, like the actual um, completion of the mission. Now one thing you want to consider is putting on hard mode does give you zero lives. So if you or your friend die, then you're going to have to restart the whole mission. Now, there's only one checkpoint in this whole actual mission and that is when you um, actually get the vehicle to the underground parking lot and pick up the uh, robbers apart from that there's no other checkpoints even if you fail at the very end or at the very beginning there is no returning there's no re restarting you're just gonna have to restart the entire mission 
So do keep in mind that because um, yeah, if you're not just uh, if you don't want to risk it, just put on normal mode. But you won't be getting that 1.5 times money NRP. Yeah, and this mission is actually really good for RP as well, which I haven't actually mentioned. You will be getting at least like 3,000 RP, which isn't too bad. This mission is pretty quick, and um, the faster you do it, um, obviously you'll be getting too much money. The RP is uh, pretty much the same. So if you're doing this mission for RP, then no matter how you, uh, how long you actually spent in the mission, then you will um, get, the, get the same amount of RP. But right here, as you can see, I'm already in the parking lot and I've already made it. Now I'm going to return and um, I've already hit the checkpoints. So now I can just um, help my friend um, get here because I need to um, like, mash out the police. But yeah, uh, after you do this, that's the first checkpoint right there. So it's pretty uh, quick to get to. And my friend has made it. So there we go, I only took like one or two minutes, which is pretty quick, and that's already halfway through the mission. So the whole mission should take only five or ten minutes, depending on how long um, you take or how good your friends are. But right here, there's a quick uh, cutscene, which you can't actually skip, which is pretty, um, yeah, it's a pretty shame you can't skip it, because it does kind of waste a lot of time. But once you actually finish that little um, cutscene, you just want to drive out of this um, little thing. Now, um, it does have a little like damage uh, meter on the rampo. And the more damage the vehicle or the rampo takes, the less money you're getting. I'm pretty sure that's uh, how it works. So you really, all you really want to do is just um, help out the, um, your friend and hopefully the vehicle doesn't actually get damaged. Now right here is actually having some difficulties getting out, so I'm just going to um, help him out. And there we go, I nearly actually smashed into him, but hopefully he goes forward. Now normally you, you're supposed to be the one that actually leads him. But actually if the rampo does go first, you can just um, wipe out the police with the rampo, I mean the ramp buggy. Is actually really fast and I can actually catch up with the rampo pretty easily so if he, if he is in trouble then you can actually just um, quickly just help him out but yeah um, the ramp buggy don't worry if a truck's coming your way or if a car's coming your way because like, as you can see right here boom all the cars just go flying so no matter how much police is in front of you uh, your vehicle won't, won't get damaged now a lot of people say that if you ramp too many cars like if you crash into too many cars the ramp buggy gets like damaged I've used the ramp buggy like a million times and I've never actually um, like died in it like my ramp buggy's never exploded but yeah, uh, let me know if the ramp buggy has ever exploded on you guys personally I've done this mission at least like 20 times and I've never actually had any problems but right here I'm actually quite low on health so I'm actually gonna go forward and I actually nearly um spin down my friend there CJ hopefully he's still okay but I'm, I'm just gonna drive forward right now and um just um, knock out some police because hopefully he doesn't die so I'm not really worried about dying because I've got ramp buggy so I don't really need to worry about police but he kind of does because a rampo is pretty slow now doing this with uh, three or four people um, might get you more money I'm not quite sure about that but the more people that do the mission the more money you might get I'm not 100% uh, sure about that but do try it out and do let me know um, but yeah hopefully this mission does help you out because um, this week and next week I will be doing a ton of money NRP methods because uh, recently on my channel I've been doing a ton of like easter eggs and different type of videos but a lot of you guys are like struggling with money NRP so I'm going to be back and doing my um, RP methods and money methods as always I'm just going to wipe out all of this police and CJ's right there so yeah, we're like three quarters way done through the mission um, we've got like a final stretch right here along the highway that should be the mission complete this mission is really easy I really haven't had any troubles with this mission if you do uh, my PSN name will be in the comments and in the description uh, it's Dennis underscore underscore YT add me on PS4 and I'll happily help all of you guys make money and RP if you guys need it but yeah um, I am level 173 so I'm near level 300 and if you want me to do a uh, level 300 like special video maybe buying like um, doing a 3 million spending spree for 300 like uh, my rank do let me know because I do have a ton of money saved up uh, just for you guys to do videos on but yeah um as always, if you are struggling with RP, then I do have a ton of RP methods on my channel that do actually still work. And um, if you don't believe me, I am super high level on G GTA and I've only had the game for like two or three months. So I do grind the game quite a lot, but I also do use my RP methods. And the older my RP methods are, the better they are, because the old methods are actually still genuine and they still do still work. Uh, some of my newer methods do involve double money and RP events, which um, aren't actually um, avail available anymore. But yeah, um, yeah, as I've already mentioned, I will be doing a ton of money methods, NRP methods. So do subscribe to the channel because I'm so close to 1,000 subscribers. And as soon as we hit 1,000 subscribers, I will be doing a spending spree. I do have um, 11 million stocked up. And I'm hoping to have 15 million uh, by the time we hit, hit uh, 1,000. Hopefully we hit 1,000 subscribers in the next maybe week or so. 
that would be amazing. But yeah, um, Ram the Rampo should be coming here um, in just a second. There he is. And in literally like a minute, we should be um, finished with the mission. The Rampo uh, has taken around a third of its health. We will, we will still get a ton of money because there is double money in our P um, an event. Now the event does actually end uh, in one week, exactly one week. So do use this method while you can. And if you don't have a CEO, then do add me on PS4 and you can just use my CEO. If, if you um, register as my um, associate, you can use my CEO um, office and stuff like that. So if you want to do this mission, uh, if four of you guys want to just um, leave your PSN names in the comments, I can just help you guys out. But yeah, uh, right here is the checkpoint. So the video is probably only like a couple minutes long. And that's how long the um, actual mission takes. So there we go. The mission is complete. No cuts, no nothing, no fakery. This is a legit method. I haven't actually cut out any any part of the video. As you can see, there's a mini cutscene which doesn't take too long. And there we go. Mission passed. Only took around 4-5 minutes. 15 GP as always. Money is really good. Nearly 30k. So if you do this, and 5,000 RP. So right there, that's the full probably effect of this mission. If you do this with 3 or 4 friends, the mission might take a bit longer. As always, as I've already said, 10 minutes is the um, like a good time you want to do this in. Now, for the video, I did it in the shortest time possible, which was, I think, like 5 minutes. If you check how long the video is and you take away like 2 minutes, that's how long the mission takes. But yeah, that's going to wrap up today's video. And this mission is super good for money and RP, as you already saw, $30,000 and 5,000 RP, which is a super good method. Now, if I do this 5 times, uh, personally, I level up. So this is how I level up really fast and how I make money. And this is personally how I saved up all of my money. I hope you guys have enjoyed today's video. And if you did, then please do drop a like. I'll see you guys in the next video.